It's your boy Wes Wave. Yep. Yeah. And we're with Ski right now. Getting hot chocolate. Right here. <laughs> you know the vibe? Ugh, the vibe. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So you're probably sitting there wondering how the fuck did I get a vlog with Ski or an interview with Ski? Probably not. Maybe you're just trying to watch the fucking video. I don't know. I don't blame you. But I'm going to just give y'all a quick explanation before y'all get into the video. So I was at Future's uh, One Big Party concert. Ski Mask somehow, some way, just managed to pull up. I was in shock. I was like, what the fuck is he doing here? He was probably the last person I would expect to be there. I went up to him. Uh, we did a video before at Lil Tecca's concert like a year ago before that. I did like a quick like TikTok interview with him, which did go pretty viral. Um, you've probably seen it before. I don't know. If you haven't, link down below. Go check out. Always the way of TikTok. Yeah. I went up to him, I was like, yo, we should run a part two today if you're down. And he's like, yeah, I got you after I come out. So I waited until the concert was done. Then uh, I got out before him. Then he came out and I was like, yo, bro, let's run the video. And then he was like, bro, uh, give me a second. And he was on the phone. He came up to me and he was like, yo, bro, can you do me a quick favor? And I was like, what's up? Drop me off to my crib and then uh, we could do the interview. And I was like, are you for real? And he's like, yeah, my driver flaked on me. I don't know why. And I was like, oh shit, all right, bet. And he's like, bro, I'll pay you and everything. I was like, bro, you don't gotta pay me. You're gonna do a whole interview with me. And you already did one before that. If anything, like, I owe you a favor. After that, I took him there. Uh, the ride was kind of weird because, like, his security guard was sitting right next to me. Ski mask was in the back. And I had my other two homies with me that were filming for me for that day. It was kind of awkward at first, but Ski was really cool. Like, we just started chopping it up. He was just telling me everything about what he's working on and everything that's going on with him. He was asking me questions about myself, like, how'd I get into this shit, which area I stay in, in Atlanta and shit. And it was pretty cool. And then we got to the place, did the interview, and here's the vlog. If I could ask if this isn't, you know, confidential, mm -hmm. next album? Yes, uh, March, March or April? March or April. Can't wait. For sure. Yeah. Still For sure. Yeah, for sure. And then since I never usually do features, I'm about to have features on there. Like um, I have Trippy on there. I'm gonna have Future on there. You have Future on there? Eat on there. I need Eat on there. I need Eat on there. Um, for sure, I have Eat on there. For sure, bro. Cause I fuck with Big I fuck with Sin City hard. Thank you. But yeah. see, that was like me trying to still be underground type shit. Like. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I was trying to do an underground sound and a lot of people didn't resonate to that shit. So. Yeah, a lot of people were hating on <laughs> it for no fuck reason. With it, I fucked with it. Thank you, bro. Thank you. But yeah. I'm gonna just do more hype shit. I'm gonna freestyle a lot more and then I'm gonna do these features. Because the only features I really have is Juice and X. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's so and trippy. So now I'm gonna actually do features with other artists, like every other artist type shit. I don't know yeah, if you I'm want actually, to yeah, ask your but question. Shit about that. Too right, <laughs> That's bro. what I was trying to tell you, bro. <laughs> I ain't yeah, never so seen that shit look like. I ain't never seen a peach hot chocolate. So hot like, as water. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my boy cranberry juice. We can, uh, we can take a seatbelt if you want to do the interview. Oh, he wants to go get the 100 for you. Oh, okay. Oh, we're, I think I have a place where we should like sit down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, we could do. Yo, you want to do it over here? Oh, yeah, that little area. Like, almost light right here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is like a round table right here. Like a little yeah. round table right here. If you want to do a standing? Yeah. Or? No this would be your first sitting there. <laughs> It'll be your first sitting. <laughs> no, I know a couple, but like... Professional. Hey, <laughs> do look kind of professional. I ain't gonna lie. Alright. Yeah, we, bro, we feel like... Look. We're right in the next amendment, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, dude. Right in the next laws, for sure. Peach hot chocolate. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, hot chocolate. Started they out. did, they did. What All flavor right. is that? Elf Bar Ting, you know, a little mint Elf tobacco. Elf Bar, shout out Elf Bar. Uh, we need that sponsorship. We need that sponsorship. For real. Hey, Newports, you been supposed to shut, fucking sponsor me. Fuck is wrong with your life short? Smoke a port, what the fuck happened? Yeah. Oh, God, bro. No. What was your favorite performance and memory with X? Damn, my favorite performance has to be one of our uh, our early performances, mm -hmm. like uh, before we got put on. So it has to be like uh, us driving probably to, um, I forgot what that was, Denver. We drove to Denver. Yeah, no, no, no license from Florida. It was our first Shit. out of Florida show. Yeah. No license? No license. <laughs> did you get pulled over? I did. And they didn't take me to jail, but they gave me a they gave me a ticket. So they got it's on YouTube. It's on YouTube. Um members only road to Denver. So I offered them a free show. How did your Yu-Gi-Oh! chain come about and what's your favorite piece of jewelry? The Yu-Gi-Oh! chain came about from um Juice World. So Juice World came up with the idea for this. Until what uh, the f oh shit, uh, little ting. God damn. Uh, Juice came up with the idea for this, and then as soon as he when he passed away, I figured that it was like it had to be 
my my job to like you feel me carry that on because it was such a good mm-hmm. idea it was such a good idea so he wanted it first for himself or like oh. he wanted it for himself yeah he wanted it for hold on, one oh second. okay yeah. what? water what's your favorite song by juice and x like separate two separate questions basically. that's a really good question yeah, we all know there. Okay. Um, yeah, we so all my favorite know song from juice we all there. has to be lean lean with it is that what it's called lean, lean with me, me. Rock with me. Rock with me. Oh, that's his best album. Smoke I'm gonna say it, bro. That's yeah, goodbye and good riddance. For me too, for me too. Favorite song on there is Lean With Me? Yeah, it has to be. I don't know why I fuck with this song. It's just such such a good playoff of the original song, you feel me? Mm-hmm. Um Other than that, for X, it has to be I probably have a favorite song from X singing wise and rap wise. Okay. Mm. Um rap wise, it has to be Bitch I Am Up. Uh, bitch, yeah, I am yeah. up. Bitch, that's my shit. Oh, then, um, song yet. Yeah, right. Singing wise, but damn. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Suicide pit go crazy too. Um, all right. For like hype song. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> but his singing songs, I'd have to say probably sad. I really like sad. Mm. Sad's one of my th- what, like one of my favorites. Oh, but I'm only saying these songs because a lot of people wouldn't know about the SoundCloud songs. You feel me? From yeah, X. that's true. But I feel like his his real fans would know. Would know. So if you want to throw those in, you can. Um. Damn, there's a song where he had a background of him and the projector screen. I'm trying to remember, it's so it's because it's so long ago, but um Members Only Volume 1, 2. Members Only Volume 1 and uh King of the King, King of the Dead, King of the Dead. That's okay. one of my favorites too from X. If you were to make your own anime, right? Mm-hmm. What would be the storyline? And describe what the main character would be like. That's funny, that's funny. Uh, <laughs> um I think my anime would be Kind of like um, Jujutsu Kaisen or um, Black Clover. It'd be some grunchy, grunge, black type shit. But like a crazy a monster or some shit? Crazy monsters. I love animes with superpowers. So if niggas have superpowers and different superpowers and you get to put them against each other, that's my yeah. type of shit. So heavy fighting scenes. I love fighting scenes. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Crazy fighting scenes. So, if anything, it would be like Attack on Titan or some shit like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's one of my favorites, yeah. And how would the main character be like? Main character, that's a good question. Damn, I'm kind of fucking with the One Punch Man kind of character, you feel me? Like, he's, he kind of don't give a fuck, but he's strong as fuck. Yeah. He still works out. So, I think One Punch Man, Saitama? Saitama. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Something like that. Ball head ass. <laughs> <laughs> what was your first experience of being starstruck in the music industry? Damn. That's a good question. I think it was either with my first time being starstruck in the industry. I think it was probably with ASAP Rocky. ASAP really? Rocky or the Migos. I'm not too sure. Or Denzel Curry. Denzel Curry. Cause How he was one. Of, mm-hmm. It was really good. Uh, the, the Denzel Curry one. He was the first one to invite me an ex out of anybody in the industry to make music with him. Yeah. You know what I mean? And he really like accepted us, let us in his house. We recorded with him that day. It was just a really eye-opening experience. You feel me? So it was a it was a yeah. good situation. Denzel Curry, either Denzel Curry, ASAP Rocky, and Migos. Okay, gotcha. Okay. How did it go with ASAP Rocky and Migos? Like, what was the experience like? The ASAP Rocky, me, me, and ASAP Rocky was pretty fire. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I think the first time I met this nigga, I did a freestyle with him. He made me freestyle. Yeah. And that's on YouTube, too. It's like, yeah, so I was in New York shopping at a thrift store, and he just shows up shopping at the same Random. store. Yeah, shopping at the same store, and he asked me to freestyle with him. And I just did it, and it, it's still viral to this day. He has millions of views on YouTube, too. Yeah. Shit's fire. I ain't gonna lie. Shit's fire. If, if they ain't seen it, they know what I'm talking about. Shit's fire. <laughs> did you meet the Migos in Atlanta? I think I met the Migos in the club. That's why I kind of why I was kind of a little starstricken because um, I was in the club and it was my early per career type of timing and it's just eye opening to see like niggas with hella jewelry doing all kinds of shit that you yeah, never yeah, seen yeah. before. You feel me? So it was just especially eye-opening. like back then in like 2015. Or yeah, shit shit was shit. crazy back then. Shit was wild. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yachty with the red the red hair. Dude, yeah, yeah. Nah, bro, that's like <laughs> Yachty with red hair. <laughs> that's yes. like 2016 though. It's peak crazy. times, bro. Yeah, peak times, peak times. If you could collab with any artist, dead or alive, who would it be? Yeah, that's a good question. Oh, uh, Kirk Bang. Oh, Amy Kirkle Winehouse. Man. I fucking love Amy Winehouse. If I could make Damn. any song with somebody, it would be Amy Winehouse. That ass. I love Amy Winehouse. And what type of vibe would it be? Some. Some smoking cigarettes for 24 hours. <laughs> 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 
rug type of feel. I don't know, but that feel that she gives like me. Like some like, mellow shit. Yeah, yeah bro, nah, some mellow. Nah, she, she's really good at making you feel something, man. That's what the mm-hmm. music I like. Even if it's not lyrical, if you can feel that shit, that's what I feel like is what speaks in music, you feel me? So. Uh, Got you. And what's your uh, favorite tattoo? And the craziest tattoo you've ever got, or craziest That's tattoo the story? Question. Oh, uh, my favorite tattoo probably has to be Wing Ridden Angel. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah. Oh, shit. Get out this shit. Just clean Ridden Angel. Yeah. You want to make some space for you, my boy? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Good sir. Yeah. <laughs> oh, life is short. Life is short. Smoke a port. That's a good. That's a good one. Damn. Oh, okay. This one has to be one of my favorite tattoos. Fuck it. Y'all know what that is? Harry Potter Slytherin. Slytherin. Oh, yeah. word. I'm about to cop the game as soon as it comes out, February. That's not even that Harry Potter uh, cloak uh, shit. Yeah, 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 that was for Halloween. I had the Slytherin on um, the cloak shit. Yeah. Okay. What's your yeah. favorite uh, Harry Potter movie? Oh, that's a good one. Wherever they first introduced Dobby. That's my nigga. Right there. <laughs> Loki. Yeah. Is that uh-huh. Is it Chamber of Secrets? I think it was Chamber of Secrets. Is that the one with the, the, the ghost girl? Mm, yeah. When they first introduced the ghost girl that's in the bathroom? The one he was in the tub in mm-hmm. the shower. That's my shit right there. I ain't gonna lie. Yes, sir. That's my shit right there. Yo, Hell yeah. One thing I did forget to mention, if you don't know who I am, my name is Waze. Better known as Waze the Wave. You can check me out on YouTube, TikTok. Instagram. I do a bunch of interviews and drip checks with rappers, your favorite celebrities, shit like that. I've been doing this for a couple years now. This was probably my first ever vlog slash like interview YouTube style video I ever made. Uh, I feel like I should have done this way before. I made more of an engagement with people that follow me. I am planning to do more of that. If y'all plan to see more of that or want to see more of that, as in more vlogs and interviews and more in-depth stuff with your favorite artists on YouTube, go ahead and hit that follow button. And as you can already see on my page, I mainly just have a bunch of shorts uploaded of like mini interviews and drip checks with your favorite rappers. Check that out, go like it up and everything. And uh, yeah, and back to the vlog. All right, it's your boy Wes Wave, I'm back on another video. It's your Here boy, my it's your boy, your auntie, Beyonce. <laughs> yes, All sir. That. <laughs> All that, dude. Hey, can we get a quick drip check, head to toe, including prices? Yeah, we got a couple of different things to put on, you know, we got a, uh, we got a little ring, I think that was 20, like a 20 or 30, 20 or 30, this was from Johnny Dang, shout out Johnny Dang. Shout out Johnny Dang. Shout out that oh, what you say? Uh, Fuck Danny. Fuck Danny. <laughs> Never ever eat the shit again, man. Fuck that food. Bullshit at Danny. If you're Danny, you whack ass. Fuck Danny. <laughs> oh, <laughs> this is like a 20 or 30. Shout out to that boy Wafi. Wafi, no, Wafi. Shout out to Jewelry Unlimited. Jewelry bro. Unlimited, yeah, Unlimited. Wafi. And then a lot of this shit is Jewelry Unlimited. So shout out to Wafi. Yeah. Shout out to Icebox and shout out to Johnny. Okay. For and sure. you would all the prices. A trip check, though. yeah, yeah. So these pants, hot topic. You wouldn't even have knew. You wouldn't even have knew, knew, nigga. You wouldn't even have guessed it. But yeah, hot topic jeans, probably like $20, $30. These the Marnies, no socks. I'm raw dog in these hoes. <laughs> I got my dog. <laughs> I got my dogs in these. Look at his face. He's shaking his head in the back. Dang, go for it. I got the uh, Polo Ralph Lauren on, you know, a nigga from Florida. So, Florida yes, shit, Ralph Lauren shit. Up. And then, um, Sukami. Sukami jacket with the door. Shit, fire. Where did you get that? This one, which one? The jacket. The jacket? Yeah, this is Sukami. That's, um, it's my boy's clothing man, but this is the, uh, a lot of girls. Oh, what's a lot of girls know Doberman. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of girls know about this. Man. Little anime dude. Yeah, yeah. little anime dude. <laughs> yeah. The do rag. Yeah. Um, the classic do rag. Priceless. <laughs> priceless. Yeah. Okay. And then the jewelry prices? Um, priceless too. But you feel what I'm saying? Uh, a little spin, things. Bro. We added a couple things. Damn. Yeah. Uh, earrings. Earrings. Well, that's what Damn. I mean. You peeped those too? No, hold on. Look at the. Uh, it's crazy. <laughs> I appreciate you. Can't. Appreciate you. Earrings was like two K. Damn. Yeah. Hell okay. yeah. Okay. I fucking with that though. You tripped out too. Hey, what? I, I feel like I'm going to Russia right now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm also awesome in shit like Alaska shit, bro. This is like, a real Alaska drip. Hey. Yeah. yeah. So-